are you recording? I'm sorry? Why are you recording? Just documenting. <laughs> Huh? Yeah, I don't want to see you Fine, I want to see you my camera. I'm not. Record like that. You can't? No. Why not? This is a post office. It's a government office. I don't want to be on camera. Oh, wow. You guys don't want to be on camera, but look, it's all up. Look at all the ones in the ceiling. She took a picture of us. I don't know who you are or what you're doing. I don't That's irrelevant. Shit, but I want to be off your camera, so get me the fuck off of it. Really? Yeah, really. That's that's and unnecessary. A lot of video people, when they ask you not to, and you do, we can take legal action. Absolutely not. Can you guys call the police department? I got the Romeo Bill police here right now. So, so it this lady right here. Uh, my issue is that this woman asked him to not film her. Time to turn my head off. Good TTA family. Back at y'all with another one. And today we at the United States Post Office out in Romeoville, Illinois. Uh, this is a request. Getting back to the TTA family list. We just want to get ready to go in here and see. If they respect our rights to record in public and to make sure that our rights are not infringed on by anyone at any time. So let's go see. I always want to come in and try to locate poster seven. See it yet, might be back. Might be back here. August 7th. 20, 2007. I'm sorry? Why are you recording? Just documenting. <laughs> huh? I'm not. You can't. No. Why not? This is a post office. It's a government office. I don't want to be on camera. Oh wow! You guys don't want to be on camera, but look, it's all up. Look at all the ones in the ceiling. Huh? And that's exactly why we can do it. <laughs> see, see, you guys are recording up there. That's not recording. That's the picture of the camera. Yeah, is it record? Is it recording us? I think I'm pretty sure I think I can good to go. Okay. Okay. Yeah, so you Yeah, so they're saying that it's a federal building. Well, she must have called a manager. Hopefully they're educator. And all these other fine folks here that we're good to go. So we'll see. It looks like that lady was just looking up. I was able to glance at her phone. She was looking up some. some she was looking at some. I'm sorry, man. Property owner's permission, which is the public, right? I have no idea. Oh yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's public property. Yeah. Why are you on it, sir? What's your name? Andre. Andre. Yeah. If you can educate everybody here that I'm good to go. I mean, you can, but what's, what's you. your reason? Well, that doesn't matter. I just want you to be able to tell everybody here that I, I can. Mm -hmm. Okay. Thank you. I'm just saying, you guys said I couldn't do it because it was federal. So you see, uh, you, you're good. Thanks a lot. So if there's well, but you're okay with the one above you. 
<laughs> you see the logic? That makes no sense. Yeah, it makes no sense. Saying she she was trying to say it's a federal building, I mean, which they have a right to not want to be recorded, though, sir. Well, if that's the, that's, the that's let me ask you something, Andre. Right? Mm -hmm. So, do I have that same right? <laughs> You're talking I, about those. Well, I'm, I just want to ask you: Do I have a right to not be recorded as well? Uh, well, you're not recording at all. But you, not we're, 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 we're recording you because. <laughs> but do I have a right not to be recorded? You're <laughs> recording you because you come in here and do something crazy, something criminal. You break that's them off. and that's true. But that's not why you're recording us. But I'm I'm just asking so, for, off your logic though. You, you made a point. You said they have a right not to be recorded. Do I have that same right? Because if that's the case, I'm gonna ask you guys to cut off your cameras. Uh, it's not it's not quite the same. That's exactly right. right. And it, it it is though. It's definitely the same. It's a camera. And then and to be honest with you, I can FOIA request that footage right now. So what, what's the difference? <laughs> No, I'm just saying, like. <laughs> okay, so again, what what's your purpose, though? Of, of are you like, are you waiting on something? Is somebody help? No, I just want to be able to come in and document the post office. I want to be able to do it unmolested if I can, you know. Uh, un Who's molesting? Well, these fine folks were just, you know, bothering me with I couldn't do it. Okay. You know, they verbally doing it. No one touched me anything, but I was being bothered. Normally when somebody audits, it's because they have a problem with something. What's the problem? What, what, well, what did we do to... Well, I, I did see the reviews on this place. You know, after I've been asked to come out here and investigate, and it's, it's okay. pretty bad. So uh, that's one of the reasons why I'm here, to investigate the personnel here. And, uh, it's bad because people ask you not to record them? Well, the, well, the reviews on you guys is... Oh, are bad. I'm yeah. Aware, but, yeah. But you, you just said we are pretty bad. Is that because we asked you? No, no, no. I said the reviews are pretty bad. Okay. So I haven't encountered you guys until right now. Okay. Um, judging by this young lady calling you, she, you definitely probably need to educate her and give her. No, for real, real, real. I mean, being, I'm being perfectly honest. That if you're the manager, she needs to be trained. I call the supervisor. Okay. Yeah, but what I'm saying, she needs she needs to be educated though. How how does she work for the post office and don't know about Poster Seven? That's not good. So we could all that's use why I, uh, I no got it uh, before the postmaster or everybody said no recording cameras in the post office. And again, you got them right above your head, <laughs> so that makes no sense. We are not going out to record. People are coming. That's correct. Yes. So what's the problem? Mm -hmm. So again, um, a lot of these people were saying I couldn't rec uh, record this lady right here, the one in the gray shirt, and this uh, uh, this young lady right here on her phone. They said that it was a federal building. We couldn't do it. However, uh, the manager Andre has came out and said that we can. So, which we already knew we could. So it's just. Uh, How that cookie crumble. We had a cam back. Yeah, there you go. Right, let me come get your license plate just in case. <laughs> yeah, she took a picture of her CTA family. I'm gonna call the cops. Well, you just you just took a picture of me. I'm stalking you. I'm not stalking you at all. When you take a video and it's against my, my I don't want you to do I can take legal action against you. You just took a picture of me, though. I don't care. Oh, you, because why? Because if you will, like you said, I'm not taking a video. I'm taking a picture. So That's I'm correct. I'm going to call the cops right now, Romeo, and I'll see what they have to say. Why, though? Because that, I could take legal action against you putting me on a video. That's why. That's that's unnecessary. I, I, don't, I don't care if it's unnecessary. It's my legal right. Okay, so if it's your legal okay. right, why would you take a picture of me? Because I don't like what you're doing here. But I don't, and you're scaring me, and I'm going to tell the But I don't have the same legal rights you do? <laughs> that makes no sense, man. Call the Romeo Police Department. Wow, she took it. She 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 took a picture of us. I don't know who you are or what you're doing. I don't That's shit, irrelevant. But I want to be off your camera, so get me the fuck off of it. Really? Yeah, really. That's that's and unnecessary. A lot of video people when they ask you not to and you do, we can take legal action. Absolutely not. Can you guys call the police department? I want the Romeoville police here right now. Wow. Yeah, so maybe you want to start heading out. No, I don't I, don't, I definitely don't run okay, from the police at all. Yeah, I'm not gonna run. Uh thank you. Your, your, your language is becoming um, a My bit... My language, what you're doing is wrong. Well, you just took a picture of me, ma'am. Oh, <laughs> <shit. Not, laughs> she said, tough shit. Wow. 
You took a picture of me, and as soon as I said I was going to come get her license plate, she just blew up. <laughs> but she takes a picture of me, and now I'm trying to see her license plate, and she doesn't like it. And she's cussing for, <laughs> you know, it's not even that serious. And now she's threatening to call the cops. And, and it just doesn't make sense. This, 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 this lady here is, wow, I would have never, you know, hey, I would have never suspected this. <laughs> you know, even the manager, you guys see the manager even came out, told everybody that, you know, good to go. And uh, this guy right here, you know, he told everybody, yeah, you, you can do it. She's asking to call the cops. She's, she's unhinged. <laughs> she is. Andre, right? Man, you, yeah. you, look, I'm going to be perfectly honest with you. You mm -hmm. said everything was good to go. I was good. Minding my business. Mm -hmm. I noticed that this young lady took a picture of me with her personal phone, which she has a right to. Mm -hmm. So all I said was, I'm just going to follow her out and make sure I get a picture of her license plate. And she just blew up. Started cussing and everything. You know, you know, that's kind of uncalled for. You're filming her. She reacts to you by taking a picture of you, and then you want to take a picture of her license plate. Let, let me ask you something. You, you say that you say that's unusual, or what? What are you saying? It sounds, it sounds like you're escalating. I'm escalating At because I hold on because I have a. I'm gonna have to ask you to leave because you're you're you came in, you did what you had to do. That's correct. You, you proved your point. Right. But at this point, you are inciting. Absolutely not. I got, a, I got it on you're, camera. You're, you're, you're causing a problem with the customer. You're, you're See, she says she's, now she's uncomfortable. This girl, this lady in this plaid kind of coat, she's uncomfortable. Sir. She's actually inciting, sir. No, you because, are. Because she you was, are. look, she was just you cussing and everything, in, sir. You came in, you proved your point that you could film. You That's correct. That's correct. But now you're trying to push it further. For what reason? Absolutely. I don't I'm, even know. Like, if you if you let us know what we did to you, then maybe we could remedy the situation. You never did anything to me. <laughs> but you have done things to uh, 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 we the people. But you're trying to fix that. No, I'm just trying to investigate so, so to see. These, these people feel like you're doing something to them, and I am in charge of this facility right so, now. So, so you're talking. So you're talking talk about feelings by asking you to leave. Okay, I will after I conduct my business here. Okay, well then I'm just gonna have to call the police because. So you're gonna, you're not gonna, you're gonna, you're not gonna um, afford me the opportunity to conduct public business here. Is, is your business to buy stamps? Or stamps and post file a FOIA. That's correct. Okay. I want to file a are, FOIA. Are you gonna do that? I'm definitely am. Like, at what point are you? Well, it, does, that doesn't matter. You, it's not a time frame on when I have to it do does. it. If you're making Absolutely the rest not. Of my patrons feel uncomfortable. Absolutely not. Absolutely not, sir. Okay. Then we'll let the police know. You, you got to do what you got to do. I'm not going to run. We I'm going to let you we be won't. perfectly honest with you. I'm not going anywhere. Please, please don't film other people in their face. Well, I'm going to film whatever I can see at this point. All right. So, you know, uh, he, said, I, I, he said, I'm the one inciting something. However, the young lady took a picture of me with her phone. So as soon as I said I was going to come out and get her a license plate, she blew up. Uh, she, now they're talking about Rome, Romeoville police. So we, we're going to definitely hang around and see what they have to say. Uh, we know that they don't even have jurisdiction on federal property. So that's going to be conveyed to them in the moment that they get here. So we'll see. Y'all stay tuned. This was another lady right here. They said she didn't feel comfortable. Being on camera, but she'll be okay. I don't even know what she said right there, but it is what it is, man. It is what it is. Still sitting here waiting around. You know, she's on her phone right there. No telling who she's talking to. Who don't really care. Probably telling who was ever on the phone that the cops are on the way. But. It is what it is. Definitely gonna wait around. I haven't done anything, so we'll see. You guys, stay tuned. TTA family. Show that shorter lady right there. She's been while we're sitting there waiting on the cops. She's been kind of talking. See, it's these three now. She's been kind of talking with her right here. The main, the main Karen. So. It's crazy though, you know what they're what they're what they're what they're mad at is when I first came in, they were like, You can't do it, you can't do it. Everybody was, you know, were, were just all over me about it. You can't do it, it's federal building, you can't do it. And then when the manager came out and said that I can, 
uh, I think that made them saltier than a peanut. <laughs> I think that's what it was. So they just tried to, they basically just tried to turn up after that. But like I said, we're going to wait and see. You can see they're talking now. Look. So, we'll see. Y'all stay tuned, TTA family. And they have arrived. And they have arrived. This cop's already telling her I'm allowed. This lady right here. How you doing today, officer? What's your, what's your, what's your name and badge number, sir? Sergeant Two, three fifty-eight. Sergeant Two, appreciate that, sir. This lady right here actually was uh the main one. I actually want to. I mean, I'm gonna, I'm gonna talk to you guys, but I'm deaf. Well, so, what, what, no, the only thing is, and, and I can, and I definitely can, and I'm definitely going to. I'm definitely going to. She took a, a personal picture of me with her phone, so I have a right to take a picture, a personal picture of her car. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. So this cop's educating her. And then she says something about the shootings in Romeo. <laughs> wow. She said the shootings in Romeo. Uh, uh, Sergeant, has there been any shootings in Romeo? There has been. Okay. What hey, that can you give me some space to talk to her, though? I mean, I mean, you, to, be, to be honest with you, Sergeant, I'm going to be honest. I mean, if y'all want, if you just create privacy, sir. I'm on a public walk and walk wherever I want. Yeah. I'm definitely going to do exactly what I wanted to do before you guys got here. She took a personal picture of me of her phone, so I'm going to take a personal picture of her car. I'm going to do that. The, the, she's been cussing at me since you guys not been here. So it, it, the gloves are off. I'm usually a nice, peaceful person, but I'm going to make sure I get a picture of her car, regardless. What are you looking at? Yeah, that's not my car. Why Why would you suspect that it's mine? Oh, because I'm acting goofy, huh? What are you looking to accomplish? Well, like I just told you precisely what I was getting ready to do, right? I'm going to take a picture of her car before she get up out of here. Definitely am. Then I'm going to file a FOIA. I'm going to get me a, buy me a couple of stamps, and then I'm going to book on out. So, you know, I'm, I'm glad that you, you guys are here trying to educate them that we do have a right to do it, and they're still not interested. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> It's not the norm, right? I mean, Most people aren't just that's a lot of stuff that's not the norm. You know, a lot of people put hot sauce on white rice. That's not the norm, but it's not illegal. <laughs> yes, that's absolutely correct. Three police officers. Oh, my God. This is this is ridiculous. I mean, it, 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 it's... If you were uncomfortable, why would you just back off of this? Ma'am, you, you, you started cussing at me. You started cussing at me. Absolutely not. Are you looking to leave? Yeah, I do want to leave. I have to go back to work. Watch your back, sir. You got a card. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that ain't going to give you. What's your name and badge number, sir? Uh, you don't want to give it? <laughs> What's your name? I, I actually first, sir. Be, officer right, they, these two officers. I, I don't just provide ID. Okay. Yeah. What's the badge number, sir? 366. Okay. Appreciate you, man, for being a uh, professional and, uh, you know, coming in trying to educate these fine folks that what I'm doing is perfectly legal. So, you know, this lady here, she started cussing at us and things of that nature. So we're going to make it, uh, we're going to make sure we get her car. You know, we're going to definitely make sure we get her license plates on camera. We have a right to do it. It's like she took a picture of us uh, and, and, and it is what it is. <laughs> so. Four, four police officers. Wow. We were just driving down the street. Oh, you, you guys never got a call? No, no, there was a call, but we were just driving down the street. So we oh, okay. Pass, so. Okay. Want to make sure everything was okay. Everything's great. Everything's good to go. Okay. How you doing, officer? What's your name and badge number, sir? Oh, you don't know it? Huh? Yeah, okay. Appreciate it. Sergeant, man, you guys were great, man. I appreciate you. you these two right here kind of. 
No, I don't have any complaints at all. Just want to be able to do what I can do uh, oh. unmolested, and we'll be good to go. All right, have a good day. Man, I appreciate it, sir. Thanks a lot. So again, this lady here, man, she's, you know, she's uh, she's definitely unhinged. She's she's definitely unhinged. And and, and officers, real quick, where's you guys' is, uh, police department located? She's right down the road, 1050 Romeo Road. So it's about a mile down on your right hand side. Okay, appreciate that. You gonna stop in? Yeah, I'm going to get some body cam footage. I noticed. What's your name again, officer? I'm Detective Wagner, badge 373. 373. He was in there talking to her. I don't know. You know, I, I did hear him say that we had a right to do it. So I appreciate that. But I just wanted to make sure we hear everything because I was out here with you guys. So, yeah, it's all good, Sergeant. Yeah, that feels uncomfortable. Yeah, but I mean, just, you know, obviously you guys are not the feelings police. <laughs> so you're law enforcement. So uh, it is what it is. She don't want us to see our car. I mean, it'd be it'd be good to detect anyway. Uh, whatever car sit here the longest, obviously it'd be hers. <laughs> we'll, we'll we'll watch the customers come and go, and <laughs> then we'll go from there. Uh, we I don't think that this, this one is since she's on this side of the police. I mean, of the post office. Maybe this white car is hers. I'm just gonna get it just in case. Yeah, so I just wanted to make that as a point. Yeah, so we're back in here. 1025 by Saturday, okay? Okay. You like to see someone sign it? Then probably you know, probably it. thought that the cops were going to come and uh, arrest me, may, uh, slam me down on the ground, maybe even tase or shoot me or something, but <laughs> to no avail. Uh, see if we can get the, uh, see if we can get this uh, manager out here. Just to see. Definitely gonna file a complaint on this office, though. It's crazy, man. That, that lady had she she didn't want me to have she didn't want her car on my camera that bad to where she had the cops drop her off. Yes, um, is there is the manager available? Still, is his name Andre? Are you the manager? Supervisor, I'm the manager. Okay, so you're over him. Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah, I just wanted to basically ask to see was he able to speak to the police? Because he did say he was going to call him. Okay, appreciate it. Let's see. He's the supervisor. She is the manager. Okay. Y'all stay tuned, TTA family. Yeah, I'm, okay, because I was, I was under the impression that you were the manager. You're just no, the supervisor. No, no. I'm supervisor. Okay, so were you able to speak to the police? I'm just asking. I mean, several people call the police, honestly. So. I, well, several people call yeah. them. Okay. Yeah. I mean, include you, though. <laughs> my, my thing is, that was for you, that was very unprofessional for you to what? do it. Uh, uh, extremely if unprofessional. I asked you to not film people's license plates and not film people in their faces. Even if I have a right to do it. And then I <laughs> asked you to please conduct your business and then leave. And leave. And, and I told you that's you exactly what I was going to do. You said you would eventually. That's correct. So so you should have honored that. I never gave my name. Okay. No, I'm asking. Oh, I'm asking. well, I don't really want to give it because I, I usually do. But but you guys have been unprofessional, especially yeah. calling the police on someone that has done nothing wrong. Oh, okay. Obviously so, right? They've came like, and left. Like filming people's license plates. That's not so, wrong. So why wasn't I taken away? Do that make sense? Obviously, the police just came and told you, even you, that I'm good to go. No, they didn't say anything. Oh, you didn't speak to them? No. Oh, okay, okay. You didn't speak. Well, obviously, they've been here. Three, four of them came, uh -huh. and they all left and said, you know, have a nice day, sir. Okay. So, so my thing is that was very unprofessional for you to call the police. Yeah. Oh. Possibly subjecting me to harm for no, some. No, no, no. I don't want you to be harmed. Wait, well, it was possible though. No, no. Yeah, with guns. You, you have a phone in your hand. Why would you? People been killed with phones all the time. I mean, yeah. <laughs> they, they, people get killed with phone all the time, yeah. so, mistaking it for a gun, right? Yeah. So my thing is, I just wanted to be able to have a quick dialogue with you at the end here, just to say that was very unprofessional. We're, so wait, we're, we're at definitely. The end? Oh yeah, yeah, we're right. At the end. Yeah, for sure. And then I take a lot of pride in that thank you go ahead ask away yeah well now i'm just saying i'm going to file some complaints on this on, on the site of course you are. for sure because we did you wrong that's correct right. and, and obviously so right yeah. because obviously. they came and left right. you guys obviously. called the police hoping that mm -hmm. i would be kicked up out of here i mean to no stop, avail and stop harassing the customers please well to no avail though right yeah, and stop <laughs> harassing the customers was the point. Of, i have no beef with you i have no problem well obviously so sir you no, call, no, think no, about no, it you called the no police problem. for nothing no <laughs> that's not true that's not true. <laughs> it's just so happens that the customers who complain about you are uh, now gone. Well, they was, well, the young lady, the other lady was out there. Okay. 
she she they actually dropped her off that she so she left her car here because she didn't want me to see her plate so she's been here the one the other lady but my thing was by you knowing poster seven right here to your right my immediate left you know I'm allowed to do it, and you still call the police. I didn't call the police because you're filming. I called the police because you're filming customers, making them uncomfortable. So you called them because I was filming. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> you just said I'm filming customers. Okay, so still, I was filming, which I have a right filming to do because it says it right there. You have a right to come in here filming. That's you correct. You do not have a right to come in here filming customers when they tell you to stop. So uh, anything my eyes can see, my camera can capture. <laughs> do, you, do you feel like you could go right in people's faces if, if you want to? I never was in that, anyone's faces. They said you were. Oh, 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 but that's just I it. Mean, you have film. Yeah, so that's just it. Did you see it though? I wasn't standing here the whole I'm saying when, when you were standing. I came up here to help the customer. Okay, so Andre, when you were standing there, you did you see me doing? We were almost at the end. Yeah, did but you, you did tell me to go ask him away. No, we are at the end, which I'm summing it up. I'm just, I just don't want you to say things that you know aren't true, no, which you have I already did. done that. I but, did. I did. but, but I'm definitely going to file some complaints. Did. did you conduct any business yet? Yes, I'm conducting business Which now. Which business did you conduct? You I'm, said two things you needed to do. Did you do either of those things? No, because I was held you up. You just said you're almost done. Yeah. You didn't conduct any business. Well, so me filming know, in public is, first of all, conducting business. To film That's correct. The pretense of saying you had other business conduct, to conduct. Right. Which you have not done, but you said you're about to leave. That's correct. I know what you want is That's to correct. A, bit, a reaction from my clerks. Really? Customers, the police here to prove your point. What you've done. Now, you're real right? quick, Andre, I'm going to be perfectly honest with you. I'm gonna be perfectly honest now, with you. Where's the business? I'm gonna be perfect, real quick. I'm gonna be perfectly honest with you. Let's just say, for your sake of argument, let's say that was my ill intentions. Let's say it was, was. Can you give me the YouTube link? I got I you. Ah, for sure, I got you. Okay. But watch this. Let's say it was, right? Mm -hmm. They still supposed to remain in character and be professional, right? Okay. Regardless. <laughs> I'm just saying. But I'll definitely write it down for you. It's almost the holidays. I mean, I'm just saying that was very unprofessional for you, Andre. So I'm definitely going to put some um, some complaints in. Uh, yeah, now, after I get done purchasing my snap and, uh, and filing the FOIA, we'll be good to go. Okay. All right, for sure. Like, I got you. I definitely got you. All right. For sure. So, yeah, TTA family, we're going to go in here. We're going to purchase a stamp, you know. Uh, like he said, you know, I'm still going to purchase a stamp. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It is what it is. I'm going to purchase a stamp. Uh, I'm still going to file the FOIA, and uh, we'll be good to go. Y'all stay tuned, TTA fan. I'm be able to file this FOIA right here. Wow. That's correct. Yeah, I want to be able to put, you know, fill out the FOIA right quick for you, Rick, real quick. And I just need you to stamp that you received it and give me a Xerox copy. I cannot. You cannot. Why not? I cannot because that's not a stamp. I can only postmark postage. Now, if you mail in an article, then I can postmark that. Are you familiar? Are you familiar with FOIA is? I have no idea what that is, but okay. I am familiar with postmarking. I understand, but the FOIA is Freedom of Information Act. So this is me requesting information and about I'm this post you, office. I cannot do that. I cannot postmark that. Okay, well, is that, well you probably maybe the manager can because you, you, you guys are definitely supposed to accept this. You can step to back again to the blue door, and it'll be the same manager that you spoke with earlier. Okay, and what's your name? My name is Veronica. Ver okay, Veronica. She She's not familiar with FOIA is. So we're we'll just... Uh, Oh, okay. So she's not uh, familiar with FOIA is. However, they do supposed to accept okay. this. Or the postmaster. Could you all come to the wheel? Oh, yeah. The postmaster would be even better. That would be great. Andre's kind of unprofessional, so we wouldn't want to keep dealing with him. But uh, we'll see, man, once the postmaster come out. That's matter of fact, that's who we want to talk to. What you say, ma'am? Oh, the postmaster? Yeah. He should. I mean, she said that he highly doubts, she she highly doubts that he would show, even though he was paid. So we'll see. Y'all stay tuned, TTA family. Ah, oh, Andre again. So yeah, the post <laughs> So the postmaster doesn't want to come? I mean, I would love to speak to somebody higher than you. I, I just seen a young lady right here. She said she was the manager. Can you so can you get her from? Oh, so you want to speak to Anyone higher than me? There you go. I see you hurt my feelings. You don't well, talk to me. Well, I mean, I'm just saying, man, we had a you know bad run in, obviously, I at the end here. But you you called the cops on me and just respectfully. I would love to speak to somebody higher than you, respectfully. Is, is that your business? That's yeah, she said she said she said she can't accept this. This is the FOIA request. Uh, yeah. She said she can't accept this. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Veronica there. Her name's Veronica, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You're so unneighborly not sharing your name with everybody. Well, I don't have to. You know, you guys are required to. 
That's the difference. <laughs> so. It's just not nice, though. Um, oh. Nice, really? We're going to talk about niceness now. <laughs> the cops were called. Oh, wow. Uh, you can't make this stuff up. <laughs> he wants me to be nice even after they subjected me to possible harm. Wow, man. Stop it, man. This guy. <laughs> this guy, man. Y'all stay tuned, TTA fam. Nope. Okay. Manager. Okay, well, that should suffice. Uh, I've been trying to turn in this FOIA to uh, Miss Veronica here. She's not interested in taking it, though. Uh, it's a Freedom of Information Act. Okay. It's a, a form. I can fill it out on any form. There's no standard form that's um, required. So that's why I filled it out on that. Uh, I'm supposed to turn it in to you guys. You're supposed to stamp receive that it's been received by you and give me a copy back. And then the appropriate person to afford it to is, uh, will be on you guys. So, yeah, that's what that's all I was trying to do. But Veronica's not interested in doing it. Gotcha. I appreciate it. Ah, uh, fine. Yeah, he's supposed to. He's supposed to accept it. Obviously, you see this young lady's doing it right here. So. Oh, okay. So, so now she's turning out to be unprofessional as well. So, I mean, I, well, I thought so until you, I just heard you say that. So, you know, this entire this entire site here, man. We definitely go file some complaints on the personnel here, though. They're terrible. But, you know, the main thing was they called the cops, hoping that the cops would probably come, like I said, throw me down on the ground, shoot me or tase me or something like that. And to no avail. So they're probably salted in a peanut at this point. I would be, too. Is there anything else I can provide you with? Um, not just to educate your staff to never call police on anybody else. Be no, for sure. So that's how that cookie crumbled today, TTA family. We're going to go from the top, from the top. Seems to me that when I first came in, like you say, all those, all those women in there, all those, all the women in there, they was all, oh, you can't do it. It's a federal building, whatever. This, that, and the third. Okay. That was cool. We had a back and forth about that. Uh, the first lady at the desk, she called the manager where the supervisor, we found out Andre. She called him. He came out. Yeah, you can do it. Even, even he still had some little back and forth about you know, if somebody was uncomfortable, but to, to, everything was good to go, I feel. You know, whatever. My thing was, when the lady took a picture of me, I actually couldn't capture it. I couldn't capture it. I, I was too slow to capture it, actually. She actually did the cam back. So I was like, oh, okay, this lady right here, the one of the, the, the main young lady that was, the main lady that was saying, you can't do it, you can't do it. I, she was in her phone in the beginning trying to look up laws about doing it. And she, you can't do it. So she had took a picture of us. I was like, oh, you know what? I'm just going to follow you outside and get a picture of your car. You know, and she just went off. Man, She started cussing at me and everything. And even Andre came back out to say, you know what? Now you're trying to incite something, which he was wrong to say that. I'm trying to cite anything. And the cops came. They weren't too bad. Two of them really did. They was kind of reluctant and hesitant to give their name, and badge number. But the sergeant was okay. I feel like the sergeant was okay. And the first cop that was talking to the lady in the inside was okay. He, he was telling her, I heard him as soon as he came in. Look, it's public. Yeah, he can do it. So that was great. You know what I mean? Uh, it's just crazy, man. And even the manager at the end here, you know, she's oh, just, just give him what he wants. You know, now he's going to antagonize. Uh, they're saltier than a peanut because the cops didn't come in and infringe on our rights today and take us to jail. That's what they're mad about because they called him hoping that they would come in and do something wrong to me, obviously, right? Then Andre at the end there is talking about I should be nice. Oh, I just think it's nice for you to do. So we want to talk about niceness even after the fact that you just called the police on me, possibly subjected me to harm, right? Possible harm, but I should be nice to you after that. Absolutely not. Y'all know TTA family ain't going like that. We don't stand for that, and we never will. But in any event, we definitely going to file some complaints. I'm going to be on it. ASAP. I'm gonna get right on that right away. This post office, like I said, it was a, it was definitely a, this is definitely a request, TTA family member. So I hope, wish, and pray that the one that actually uh, requested me to come here, you see this video, man. You see, you see what's going on. I'm glad you called me out here to do this right here. We back with the list, <coughs> back on the list, man. So we uh, we gonna be shake rattle road. That's how it's gonna go, and uh, we should be good to go. So. Everybody that's been tuning to the, to the channel, man, I love you guys wholeheartedly, man. Y'all been rocking with TTA. Appreciate you guys. Get ready this Sunday, just a few days from now. We back live, 2 p.m. Central. 
So make sure you don't want to miss that. A lot of y'all seen y'all miss that. Uh, let's see if there's anything else. I think that might be it. Yep. So until the next time, y'all stay locked in with me.